Hey guys, Ben from Snows here today with Austral's deluxe folding table with storage. Hit it. So I've got with me here today guys, the Austral folding table with storage. It's a camp table and a camp pantry kind of all in one. If we have a look at the size of it when it's packed up like this, it's 60 centimeters by 60 centimeters and eight centimeters thick this way. It weighs about seven and a half kilos. I'm gonna show you how to set it up today. First thing we need to do is undo these clips on the end and fold it open. So from new, these tables have a bit more packaging inside here and this probably won't be attached. This is our display model here. So we've already got this covered section of the table attached around the legs. It's just Velcro and um, wire or metal strips across the top here to put it in place, but that's easy to do. So inside here, we've got the two shelves, which give our cupboard underneath a bit of structure. And we've got four legs, for which there's actually eight sections. So each of these screw apart and give different heights to the table. We'll show you a bit more on them later. First thing we need to do to set this up is there's two end leg sections. We've got to fold them open and lock them in place with these yellow clips here. There's a couple more latches we need to slide into place before we go any further. And that's in the middle here. If we slide these across and they stop the table from folding in half. Without them done up, the table will still completely fold. So just slide them into place. Next step is to attach your legs. So there's actually three sections to these legs. We've got two little uprights here and a little foot on the bottom. Now this gives us height options for the table and a bit of adjustability for uneven ground. If I want a table that's low to the ground, I can take this short section and screw it into the end here and take my little foot and screw it in there. It gives me an adjustable leg at a low table height. Alternatively, I can use the medium or the, the longer section, screw that in there with the foot in the ends, gives me a medium height table. Or what I'm gonna to do today is attach both of these together with the adjustable foot in the ends. And then this just screws into the end here. And we do that for all four legs. And there's one other thing I want to show you before I flip the table over. It's going to be easiest to, to demonstrate how this attaches to the table while it's upside down. So on each leg, there is a Velcro strip that just attaches to the leg. If I undo the two on this end here, we can now see where this attaches underneath the table here. This is a sleeve around a bar. Now this bar is removable. I can just pop that out and it comes out of the sleeve there. There's three of these, one of the ends, one in the middle, and the same thing at the other ends. So it's quite easy to remove this pantry if you want. It's also really easy to put back on. So I just put this back in the sleeve and this attaches up, clips into place here. They may rattle out of place while it's in transport. So you might need to check it when you set it up. And then we just attach these loops around each leg. And so we are ready to flip our table over. And that's the Austra folding table with storage almost set up. One last step and that's to put our shelves in the cupboards here. Now, putting our shelves in is nothing technical. We just unzip the mesh doors on the front here, slide the shelves in, close them up again, and that gives us a nice flat platform for storing our food, kitchen utensils, or whatever we need. A couple of other things I'll mention once we've got this set up is to just make sure these legs are pulled out as far as they'll go. Don't kind of leave them bent in like this because the table's not, not level. Pulling them out gives us a nice flat tabletop. We've also got these legs that we can adjust here. So we've got both sections on here, which is a full height table. Uh, and we've also got the adjustable feet on the bottom here. Now one of these is on all four legs. So if this is on uneven ground, we can make a nice level tabletop no matter where we set it up. Pack ups, just as easy. First thing we need to do is take the shelves out, uh, flip it upside down and remove the legs. So that's the shelves out and the legs off. Um, before we go any further, what's a good idea is to make sure I've left these doors unzipped. We make sure they're just tucked inside the table. It saves them getting pinched when we fold it up later. Next thing to do is invert the yellow um, struts on each corner and fold the legs in. And as we fold these, just make sure the fabric tucks right inside the table so it doesn't get caught up in the top as we're folding it. So that's all folded inside the edges of the table there. Now we grab our legs. We can just tuck these inside one of these pockets here if we like, just to keep them secure. Put our shelves on top of that. And the next thing is these latches on the side. We can't fold it up until we undo both of these latches. And then we flip the table over. Always easy to fold the half that doesn't have the loose bits in it so they don't fall out anywhere. As we push it down, just make sure once again that the cupboard is all tucked up inside the table. Stand it up on its end and we can do these latches up. 
That is our Ostra folding table with storage, all packed up, ready for transport. Now they don't come with a bag. You can get the Austral furniture bag in the medium size. We'll fit this guy here and keep it protected in the back of your car. You can grab these at snowies.com.au at lowest prices every day. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Don't run away on us yet, guys. If you thought that video was useful, you might like to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on any of the latest information. Or just give us a like. Let us know if you've got any comments down below. Or alternatively, check out some of our other videos on our other camp furniture.